Hey guys, so today I'm doing a video about two of my biggest fall splurges. I feel like most of my splurge items are items that like are most usable in fall slash winter, if that makes any sense. I don't know. I'm Canadian, so obviously like friggin' eight months out of the year it's cold. So basically, yeah, these are two items that I was just like dying to have. So yeah, I want to share both of those with you. So let's get started. So the first item is from Stuart Weitzman and they are the Lowland Boots. So first of all, this is just the big bag that it came in. And then fancy receipt, fun thing. And then we have the box, which is freaking heavy as hell. So yeah, it's huge because the boots are thigh high as you will see. So that's what they look like inside the box. They're basically folded because they're like soft cloth. Then underneath, it just comes with a dust bag. I'm just gonna show one because like holding them both up is like tedious work. <laughs> so basically, yeah, at the back, there's this really pretty like leather tie and you tie it in a bow and it just looks so pretty. I'll insert a picture of me wearing them. And yeah, so this basically, there's just like a small little heel at the bottom and they're like suede material. These do come in different colors. I know there's like a more like camel color and I think they even have a maroon color if I'm not mistaken. And this year they newly came out with a leather um, version of this boot and it is really pretty like off but on it looks kind of strippery. <laughs> so I, you know, decided against the leather. The suede looks much more like sophisticated and it's just such a pretty boot like it's so so pretty at first I was a little hesitant to buy a boot that does go thigh high because I'm only like literally five feet tall but honestly like they look really like nice I don't know I really really like them so obviously I went into the store to try them on first I wasn't about to like make this purchase like on a whim so I went into the store white store I tried them on and yeah, I don't know, I just fell in love with them and then I decided, okay, I'm going to save up for these. And then eventually I got them. So yeah, they just go over the knee, as I said, and you actually can fold them down if that's more the look you want to go for. And I feel like this tie literally just makes the whole, like it just looks so, so pretty from behind. So yeah, that's pretty much these boots. And I just feel like these are super wearable too. Like this would look so cute with like a skirt and tights or like a cute winter fall like dress, jeans, leggings. Like you can literally, like you can't go wrong. They're just super pretty. I mean, these are definitely not like, I would not go trudging through snow in these or anything, but they're definitely wearable. You just have to be careful with salt and like that kind of thing. But the lady did give me care instructions and it came with a little buffer. So yeah, I will definitely take very good care of these things. I'm someone who definitely takes very good care of my belongings. Like if I'm gonna like splurge on something, like I'm not gonna go like not taking care of it and that kind of thing. So anyways, that is the boots. They are literally ginormous. I'm super happy with this purchase. And if you're looking for a pair of thigh high boots this season, I would definitely look into these. They're so, so pretty. And I am in love. And the second splurge item is from Aritzia by the brand Macage, and it is their leather jacket. So Macage is known for leather, and I put this scarf on just because I feel like it looks pretty. <laughs> so yeah, Macage leather jackets are definitely, you know, not really on the cheap side, but it's something I really wanted. I wanted to invest in a good leather jacket, and I knew from friends that this brand is really, really good. One of my friends, Crystal, does work at Aritzia, so huh, shout out to you, girl. Um, and she does have this jacket too, and it looks flawless on her, so I just really wanted to get it too. <laughs> and yeah, basically just, there's the tags, fun stuff, not really. And yeah, I don't know, I can't wait to wear this. And it has like that like moto style collar, two buttons here, two buttons there, so you can like do it up if you want. It does have a zipper, but I don't know, I feel like I'm someone who like more so wears it with a scarf and then like leaves it open with like a cute knit underneath. So I don't know, that's just my personal preference. You could obviously totally zip this up if you wanted to, but I don't feel like I will personally do that. And then it has zipper closure um, pockets as well on both sides. And the back is just relatively plain, nothing too crazy going on. But I did want to share this purchase with you because I just feel like if you want to invest in a good leather jacket, like there's obviously like Danier and those types of brands, but I feel like Macage is definitely like something that like not a lot of people know about for some reason. Um, 
And they are kind of hidden at Aritzia. It's really weird. Like they're randomly like sprawled across the store. And I almost forgot to mention <clears throat> this jacket is called the Kenya jacket. There's obviously many different styles of this jacket, but this particular one is the Kenya one. And I don't know, this was particularly my favorite because a lot of the other ones were much more like, like two moto for my liking, like leather belt with like a buckle and just like, I don't know, I just feel like this is the perfect mix of like moto girly, like still feminine, not too like man repeller. <laughs> I don't know. So yeah, I don't know. I just really, really like this. And if you are looking to invest in a good leather jacket, I would definitely go to Aritzia and check out Macage. If you're not Canadian, because I know Aritzia is Canadian, um, Macage definitely does have a website online, so you can look at them there. Um, the Kenya was definitely my favorite, but yeah, look into all of them. They are such, such beautiful jackets, and I cannot wait to start wearing this in the fall. Thanks for listening, guys, about my two new fall purchases. I hope maybe it inspired you to make a purchase. I hope this helps with any fall shopping you may want to do. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.